welcome students, family, friends, and distinguished guests to the virtual commencement exercise for the graduating class of 2020 for Century High School and Independence High School. My name is Nikesha Johnson, and I am one of two counselors for these two magnificent high schools. Tonight, despite this pandemic, we gather here virtually to recognize our students and celebrate their achievements that have led them to the completion of their K-12 academic career. Our students have worked very hard to get here, and we want to celebrate their successes. I would like to introduce Michelle Mercado as she leads us in the flag salute. Please remain standing as a special guest sings the national anthem. Class of 2020, please stand. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. My name is Lauren Marie Martinez Capila, and this is for class of 2020. Thank you, Michelle and Lauren. At this time, I would like to introduce the Alhambra Unified School District Board of Education President, Mrs. Pat Rodriguez McIntosh, to give a special welcome to our graduating class of 2020 on behalf of the Board of Education. Hello, graduates. This graduation is definitely a year to remember. You are the best. We are so proud of you, how you've handled yourself with the challenges of closing schools, distant learning, not being able to attend your prom, grad night, or even a normal graduation. Your class of 2020 will go down in history. One day you'll be able to tell your children or even your grandchildren how you were a part of that history. So we would like to wish you all the best and a great successful future. Congratulations to this class of 2020. Thank you, Mrs. McIntosh Rodriguez. At this time, I would like to introduce our principal, Mr. Fong Nguyen, to give a welcome address to the class of 2020. Good evening. Before I address the class of 2020, I'd like to take a moment to thank your parents who have been by your side and worked with us the last few years to support you. For those at times you might not feel like it, but trust me, they were there. They were there with you. 
I'd like to thank our teachers and staff for their hard work in supporting you. I'd like to thank our counselors, Mr. Johnson and Ms. Tran, for always being there for you. Last but not least, a very special thanks to Mr. Abel Bobois in supporting you academically and especially putting this whole virtual graduation together. A lot of details work to make this happen. So thank you. Class of 2020. This is certainly a bit bittersweet moment in life. I am filled with joy that you have earned your high school diploma. Yet, I am sad I'm able to join you and your family in person to celebrate you in this rite of passage. For you today, represent the end of one journey and the commandments of a new one. High school graduation is a new beginning. I'm sure this new beginning will present itself with many challenges. This global health crisis affects every single one of us in one way or another, either physically, socially, emotionally, and or financially. For you, looking ahead, could be possible distant learning for college, deciding to postpone going to college, difficulty in obtaining employment, and many, many more. But let's take a moment to reflect back the last four years of your life. For you to get here today, you have faced and conquered many challenges, and none of them were small. You have faced hardships and fought hard to overcome them. You stumbled and were knocked down, but rather than accepting defeat, you got right back up, dusted yourself off, and kept going. You also endured many naggings from your parents, your teachers, your counselors, and at times, me. Although you did not follow a conventional path, some of you are about to become the first in your family to graduate. Some of you will go to college. Some of you will go straight to the workforce. Some of you will join the military. And some of you might set up some more thinking to do. Regardless, the key was you hung on. You made it. So before I close, I'd like to leave with you a few advice or just things that I have learned as you leave us to move on to the next chapter of your life. First, take care of your family. Keep them close. Social interaction is critical for human beings. Certainly this COVID-19 taught us that. So please don't waste any opportunity to be with your family. Second, whatever you choose to do, live a life full of purpose. Dedicate yourself to helping others by paying it forward. Kindness is a gift all of us can afford to give at any time, especially during this pandemic. Third, believe in yourself. Give it your all in everything that you do. Put the naysayer aside, the negative people. You know who they are. And every time you fall, get right back up and start again. And finally, always, always keep that hope alive in you. In everything that you do, hope makes all things possible. Class of, class of 2020, thank you for the opportunity to be your principal. I am very proud of each and every single one of you. I'm confident that our best days are ahead of you. Congratulations, class of 2020. Thank you. Next, I'd like to introduce our next speaker, Mr. Martin Ulola, who is retiring this year after 29 years of service with Independent High School. Mr. Ulola. After 29 years, of teaching, it's time to call it a career. I will enjoy my free time laying in bed, watching the news in the morning and doing some woodworking and maybe driving my car as a Lyft driver. I will miss teaching and I will miss
meeting with my students, but it's time. And so I think of all the students I have encountered and many are successful. Um, and I hope that they will carry out a fruitful career. So as a farewell note, Congratulations, the class of 2020. You have reached a milestone in life by earning a high school diploma. You have given yourself a better chance of earning more money over a lifetime. Better jobs will be available than without a diploma. As you go forward into this wild, woolly, and challenging world, don't ever give up. You've made it this far. You can achieve more. When I see, when I see the class of 2020, I see professionals of tomorrow. As Chevy Chase in the movie Caddyshack said, there's a force in the universe that makes things happen. All you have to do is get in touch with it. Stop thinking, let things happen, and be the ball. So be the ball and move forward into the future, making your future a prosperous one. Aspire to your potential, keep pushing forward, and achieve the goals, whether it's a college career, a military career, trade internship, or directly into the workforce. Don't ever give up. Opportunities will avail themselves when you least expect it. Finally, remember, learning is a lifelong endeavor, so don't stop learning. Again, congratulations, the class of 2020. Thank you, Mr. Uola. In preparation for the next part of a student's journey, many of our students have been recognized and awarded scholarships. At this time, I would like to invite our counselor, Ms. Lucy Tran, to recognize our scholarship recipients. First, I'd like to say congratulations to the graduating class of 2020. You guys all did it. Now, the following students have been recognized with a scholarship or award as a result of their scholastic excellence. From the Alhambra Chamber of Commerce Scholarship, Adam Aldana and Lizette Ramirez. From the Alhambra Latino Association Scholarship, Brian Lugo Pena and Helena Villanueva. The Alhambra Management Association Scholarship, again, we have Helena Villanueva and Michelle Mercado. The Alhambra Teachers Association Scholarship, Angel Flores Cahuo and Keely Wu. The American Red Cross Scholarship, Destiny Miranda. The Asian American Association Scholarship, Andrew Avila Ong. The Asian American Association Most Improved Scholarship, Emily Maceda Gonzalez. The San Gabriel Valley New Generation Rotary Scholarship, Ashley Hayashi and Italia Miguel. The West San Gabriel Valley Realtors Scholarship, Dulce Nunez Flores. And for the first time ever, the Principal's Rising Centurion Scholarship, we have Trinity Hernandez. And the Principal's Rising Eagle Scholarship, we have Linda Lamb. Congratulations to all of our deserving recipients. We're all very proud of each of you. Congratulations. Thank you, Ms. Tran. At this time, I would like to introduce Mr. Abel Bubois to introduce our student speakers. Thank you, Mrs. Johnson. Good evening. It is my honor to present our student speakers. When I think of the class of 2020 at Century and Independence, I think of a resilient spirit and the courage to grow. Our speakers have grown so much personally and academically during their time with us. The students are a reflection of the transformation all of our graduates have had during high school. I'd like to introduce our first speaker, Dulce Nunez Flores. Good afternoon, fellow graduates and family, or should I say this as an adult? I hope you are doing well during these unusual times. 
The world we live in is affected with many different hardships. COVID-19, ISIS, physical distancing, distance learning, even facial acne. But in spite of the odds, we managed to graduate. Please give yourself a pat on the back. Not graduate. You may not know me, but my name is Dorset. Though we do not want to ask going on each other personally, I'm sure we all had our own barriers to overcome to get to this day. Please sit or stand here with me with pride and your head up because we made it. Despite what 20 throws at us, we continue to rise and give our best to achieve our dreams and goals. Many of us have overcome hardships, some lost loved ones, even yourself, or even your homework. But despite what we went through, I want to tell you that I'm proud of you. And you should be proud of yourself too. I personally, I personally never saw myself making it this far. But what I did know is that I didn't want to be another statistic in the system. And I wanted to prove myself and others that this was possible. The odds of graduating high school is by a many different factors. Home life, family support, actually attending school. I can only say I like support in all areas. Okay, maybe not school because you know how much I bug us to attend school but it's because they care about us. I'm proud to say that I wish my goal of graduating high school with the support of a loving home or loving family. Today, I'm proud to say that I graduated high school despite being in the foster care system. It was incredibly difficult and I fought against any support I did have. But I realized that because I'm a foster kid, it doesn't mean that I'm less capable of reaching my goals of standing or sitting here and making history for myself and for yourself. Today we celebrate all of us, us being in the act of, be of becoming a high school dropout. Today marks the beginning of a new journey. Today is full of hopes, dreams, limitless possibilities. My fellow graduates, keep pushing, keep fighting, keep dreaming, keep making history. And above all, you believe in yourself. Class of 2020, we did it. Thank you, Dulce. Next, I would like to introduce Alfredo Esquivel. I'll first like to start off by saying congratulations to the students of Century Independence High School, Class of 2020. Uh, I know we worked very hard to get here. Despite all the things we might have gone through, we still pushed forward. I'd also like to say thank you guys for giving me the opportunity to represent the students. Despite all the things we might be going through right now, like not being able to walk on stage and celebrate with friends and families, I think we can still learn a lot from all of this. Like being th thankful for the memories and, and friendships we have made throughout the years. Uh, I'd also like to say thank you to the teachers and staff who believed in us, who never gave up on us, even when we ourselves gave up on uh, each other, you know. Uh, I'd also like to say thank you for just going above and beyond to support us and helping us through our life in high school. We would always keep this in our hearts. Even though we're not able to enjoy this with our friends and families, I think we can still be proud of the fact that we've made it this far, that this part of our our lives, is, this chapter is over, and that we're going on to do better and greater things with our lives. Uh, I also think that it's up to us, each and every one of us, to do the best at what life throws at us. I'd like to say thank you guys. Uh, you guys are the best class of 2020. I wish you guys the best in luck in life, and thank you. Thank you, Alfredo. Next, I would like to introduce Rose Ibarra. A digital warm welcome to the graduating class of 2020. My name is Chantal Ibarra, though most of you know me by Rose, and I'm honored to be your speaker for this digital ceremony. First, I would like to give a warm thank you to the teachers, faculty, staff members, families, friends, and our principal. You all have pushed us to strive for this moment and to plan for our future careers to teach us the responsibilities that we will need to shape ourselves better with. Unfortunately, our ceremony has been pushed to be online and in the safety of our homes due to the coronavirus pandemic. Even then, we should still celebrate the milestone of getting through high school and moving forward in the paths that each and every one of us has dreamed of. 
In this time, we are living in what may be a new chapter in the future history books that our children may read. So let's make the most of it. Prove that this obstacle that we faced will only make us braver and stronger for what may come later. I would also like to acknowledge the strength and persistence in my peers that are beside me graduating this year. I have seen students with issues and struggles that are holding them back. And yet, those same students with heavy weights and fear have pushed through that barrier, breaking some chains to be here today. If you are one of those students, I congratulate you and wish you the best of luck in your future because I know it will be a long road ahead of us. It's only just the beginning. Walt Disney had a motto, dream, believe, dare, and do. Meaning that dreams can only be a dream unless you take that dream and you give yourself that faith to try and make your dream come true. And maybe in the process of making that happen, it will come true. And it'll be the biggest accomplishment you have yet. I took that model to heart. I almost didn't graduate. I was severely sick in my four years of high school, but I pushed myself to find a way to make my dream of graduating happen. And I found myself here in Century High School. Funny enough, I lived in the next building, an apartment complex, two and a half years ago. And I never imagined that this same building would allow me to accomplish my dream to graduate. With all this said, everyone has done the best in their time here, and I hope and I have faith that everyone will accomplish another milestone after this one and live the happiest, most fruitful life that you can imagine. So keep dreaming and stay safe. Congratulations. Well, congratulations, class of 2020. We finished. Thank you, Rose. Next, we will move to a very important part of the graduation ceremony. In this step, our board president certifies the graduating class of 2020. Mr. Nguyen, please present the class of 2020 to the Alhambra Unified Board of Education. Board President Patricia Rodriguez McIntosh, upon recommendation of the faculty of Century High School and Independent High School, I certify that the students presented virtually today have completed all the local and state requirements to participate in the commandment ceremony of Century and Independence High Schools. Mr. Nguyen, on behalf of the Alhambra Unified Board of Education, I accept your recommendation regarding the Class of 2020 certification. And upon your acceptance, I now proudly present to you the Century High School and Independent High School Class of 2020. Congratulations, Class of 2020. I am very proud of you. Raymond Anthony Acuna. Simone Yim Adams. Daniel Aguirre Esther Alcala Maris Michelle Alejandra Alcala Maris Adam Aldana Jennifer Michelle Alvarez Andrew Avila Ong. Tiana B. Bailey. Javier Barreto. Janelle Emily Barrios. Catherine Celeste Belendez. Jacob Benitez Matthew Joseph Benitez Christopher Bonilla 
Megan Madison Bonilla Acosta. Andrew Jacobray Cassi. Anahi Guadalupe Camacho. Daisy Cespedes. John Anthony Chavez. Nelson Kaylin Chang. Lena Raylene Cobarubius. Devin Daryl Cowan. Andrew Joseph Cruz. Johnny Cruz Chepi. Elias Nicholas Dominguez. Jacob Andrew Doty. J. Duarte Ortega. Jameson Andrew Edrelin. Melody Espinoza. Alfredo Ezekiel Esquivel. Sitlali Esquivel. Christian Gabriel Estrada. Jose Luis Felix. Alexia Kalani Fierro. Jose O'Daly Figueroa. Jack Flores. Jennifer Flores. Angel Jesus Flores Cohuo. Aiden Jameson Fuller. Crystal Galeana Rodriguez. Erica Jessica Gallegos. Ruben A. Garcia. Sarahi Maite Garcia. Art Lawrence Garnica. Angel Gomez. Ashley Serena Hayashi. Brianna Janelle Hernandez. Diego Alberto Hernandez. Elizabeth Bianca Hernandez. Stephanie Juliana Hernandez. Trinity Carmen Consuelo Hernandez. Mariana Carolina Herrera. Lewin Calvin Hoy. Chantel Ibarra. Benjamin Russell Jara. Jia Tong Ju. Vivian Catherine Cato. Shan Somali K. Linda Lamb. Wen Jun Liu. Daniel M. Lopez. Brian Lugo Pena. Nathan Tyler Lee. Emily Maria Maceda Gonzalez. 
Joseph Alexander Maestro Montoya. Aiden Katsu Maloney. Juan Diego Monriquez. David Alexander Mars. Anthony Martin. Jesus Juan Martinez. Angel Daniel Mejia. Erwin Oteniel Mendez. Michael Denora Mercado. Italia Miguel. Dean Jordan Mimura. Destiny Alexis Miranda. Lamberto Jesus Mondragon. Oscar Manjaras. Michelle Abigail Monroy. Catherine Concepcion Moreno. Joshua Christopher Murrow. Jeremy Joshua Nava. Wesley Chun Yu Ng. Dulce Maria Nunez Flores. Daniel Alex Nungaray. Heaven Gloria Olguin. Alan Josue Ortiz Mata. David Palayas. Anthony James Perez. Julian Pineda. Jamie Natalie Portillo. Jason Preciado. Alejandro Juvi Ramirez. Lisette Ramirez. Journey Sophia Rongel. Justin David Renteria. Nelson Rene Robledo. Alia Blanca Angelina Rodriguez. Johnny Anthony Rodriguez. Michael Morrison Ruiz. Kayla Angelique Sagastumi. Kimberly Jasmine Sanchez. Lee Yi Ro Shen. Dorian Christopher Smith. Andy Tran. Leanne Marissa Valdez. Jaden Gregory Velasco. Jose Luis Velasco. Herman Vergara. Angel Alberto Villalba. Helena Claire Villanueva. Keely T. Wu. Kevin Wu. Beverly Xiao Hong Yu. 
Gia Nicole Zavala Gutierrez. At this time, I would like to introduce Josh Moreau as he leads the students in the changing of the tassel. The changing of the tassel from right to left has a great educational significance. Those who have earned the right to move their tassel to knife are considered to have completed all requirements and bring to an end our tenure as students of Century and Independence High School. Will the class of 2020 please stand? Class of 2020, please move your tassels from right to left. I now proudly present to you the Century High School and Independent High School Class of 2020. Congratulations, Class of 2020. I am very proud of you. This concludes our commencement exercise. Parents and guests, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Students, Congratulations on your graduation. We wish you nothing but success in the future. Congratulations again, class of 2020. Thank you and good night.